morning everybody and welcome back to Lally Valley Game Reserve. Um, it is an absolutely stunning morning. We had a bit of rain yesterday and the sun is just about to come out. So I'm going to grab a couple of other guides and we're going to head out to the bush and see what we can find today. Well folks, we've managed to relocate one of the female cheetahs. Uh, she's sitting all head up and uh, into we unfortunately looking into the sun so it's not great we're just going to let her get comfortable with us and then move around so we can uh, get a better visual of her but this time of the early morning sun has just broken over the mountain tops it's going to be a fantastic time for her to possibly go out and hunt just a much better shot of her on this side she's been looking around quite intently you know, possibly looking for a potential meal um, here she is, she's up and going now. I know across on the other slopes we did see some antelope from here. It'll be quite difficult to pick them up in the camera. But just as she's got up on this trot, there's definitely something that has sparked her interest. Now we can see she's fo intently focused on something up on the hills. Now when cheetahs hunt, they have got an amazing binocular vision. Their eyes are phenomenal and pick up antelope from many 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 hundreds of meters away so she'll be looking um even now this she's slightly up on a hilltop now being able to look out onto the open plains and just assess the area around her what prey what potential threats are in the area and then from there she will decide on whether to hunt or not but just everything about her body language at the moment is suggesting that she will go and have a look around a scout around and possibly even go and attempt a hunt or two cheetahs are fairly successful hunters um however they do lose quite a lot of their kills to other predators such as lions and hyenas and even some of your smaller predators like jackals and that will often try and push them off now cheetahs being mainly solitary so this is a solitary female only time she really does have other cheetahs around is when she meets up with a male for mating and then when she has cubs uh, the, the courtship can last not much longer than a couple of days but when she does have cubs um, she'll be pregnant for just just on three months and then she will give a litter anything up to six cubs generally only two or three cubs make it to their first year and at about 14 to 18 months depending on development cubs will leave her or she will actually leave them fall pregnant again and go and have a another litter but by a year and a half cheetahs off should be self-sufficient and move off on their own or as a sibling group but she keeps on moving up towards the hills in the background there so she's definitely seen something and, uh, she's got quite a good cover here this tree cover but also nice big open areas where they can use their speed i mean cheetahs can get to between 90 and 100 kilometers in a matter of seconds but they can only maintain that speed for a short period of time so they won't just waste their, en their energy just randomly running around they will scout make sure that they are have got the best advantage to be able to hunt without uh, causing themselves any damage or just wasting on one wasting any energy folks we're gonna just leave this cheetah just overlooking the plains and uh, keep following up on her a little bit now i uh, hope you enjoyed this video remember please send us through any questions comments and remember stay safe